guys, welcome to another episode of Here Reviews the World. And in case you haven't noticed, today's topic may or may not be about dinosaurs. Everybody's favorite topic, especially mine. So this is something I accidentally unearthed in the most adventurous place in the world right now. Target. And so this is a really cool and I thought I'd make a review about it. It's called Dino Strike. Five surprises. Now it's supposed to be um, for dinosaurs and as you can tell by all the apparel I'm wearing, I love them. It says, unbox and battle, surprise dinosaurs. 13 dinosaurs to build a battle. Well, let's hope I get a cool dinosaur. So let's go on with it. So uh, I have two actually right here. So today we're going to open up two of these to see how my look is. <laughs> Hopefully I get a cool thing like uh, maybe a Spinosaurus or a uh, T-Rex, you know, just a lot of cool dinosaurs. And I haven't cut into this yet, of course. Now this actually has really weird boxing details, like once you open it, I saw that in the ad that I looked up for this. And it's still not open. Okay, yeah, this might take a while. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, so, uh, actually, by the way, uh, does anybody have any questions? Oh, uh, yes, you in the back. Oh, you, oh, you're asking if it's uh, fine if you comment and subscribe, I mean, like and subscribe. Yes, that is fine. And also, please comment down below your favorite dinosaur. Okay, so now that I've opened this, uh, let's see what it, this is all about. Of course, I haven't opened it because this just this packaging does not like me. Okay, now that I finally have opened this, I am notorious for not being able to open packages. This is the packaging. It's sort of, it's sort of like a sliced orange. So let's see what type of things we can unbox with a second layer of wrapping because why not? <laughs> and as you can tell, I do not, I love dinosaurs. I just do not like the wrapping for the dinosaur toys that always come. Oh, okay, so as you can see, this is about to split. And I'm gonna choose this one as this original. And of course, if you see at the top, it's really, oh, okay. I just busted it out. Are you guys ready for the slice? Oh, I got a Triceratops. One second. You can tell it's a Triceratops by the distinctive three horns and frill used to protect its neck. Yeah. <laughs> Really cool and yeah. I also got its, uh, shoot, I dropped something, one sec. Two of its legs. It's really cool. It's orange, so here's the next slice. If I can actually open it, there we go. And here's the blaster I got for it because these are uh, Dino Shrike things, uh, it wouldn't be complete without the Shrike in it. So, as you can see, there's a little button right here for this red missile to launch, and let's see how far it can go. Okay, it's completely offset. <laughs> One second, let me pick that up. Okay, sorry guys. Now let's uh, move on to the next one. This is the body of the Triceratops. One second as I piece this together. Oh geez, this is hard. Actually, my first question is, can we actually mix and match these? Because if we can, I'm gonna make some weird abominations. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so, so far, this is what we have. I'm gonna, this. Triceratops, right here. I'm gonna lay it down. Us to see. So we're down to our final two. So it, we're gonna get the back legs and armor. I oh, and the tail. I completely forgot about this. There we go. It has a nice color scheme, though. Uh, and. 
And as you can see right there, we have a complete um, triceratops. But that doesn't mean we have a complete figure, no. Because what we need is armor. <laughs> see, this is what makes it really cool too. Because you can add on a lot of armor, as we can see right here. One second, as I try to figure out where this goes. So this goes on the back and, one second. You have to piece these together outside of the thing, so. Oh wow, uh, this is very strange, okay. So, <laughs> this is actually really hard to put together. So, um, for the armor, it's actually quite cool though to look at that, because now we have armor on its back and both of its front legs gone. And we can also put on this harness for the eyes and stuff like that. As you can see, really cool looking dinosaur. It wouldn't be complete without its little blaster on top. Now, uh, let's move on to the second one. So here's what we have on the table already. Now I'm sorry that this is long, but as people say in a show business, the show must go on. So, uh, Jeez, again with the packaging. <laughs> uh, yeah, but I actually like it. It has a very stylized design, so it actually looks quite good. And we got a super iconic dinosaur, so hopefully we can find another iconic dinosaur. Oh jeez, okay. There we go. So here's our second orange and our first slice of that orange. Now I find the best part is just to crunch it up and take it up. Okay, the most uh, rare ones, if you actually look at the uh, description, are the bone ones. I just got a bone <laughs> one. So, uh, so let's see what the skeleton leads to. Well, you could say that we're digging up a lot. Okay. So this is the first part of it. Let's move on to the, oh, the next part just came right at us. It is a bit of the armor and the front legs. This is actually starting to look like an ankylosaurus or something. Now, uh, the front legs have been placed right there. Now the next one in the countdown is tail and hind legs. For the tail, you have to like put it in between, so one second. There we go. So I think this is an ankylosaurus uh, hopefully I'm right, but this is actually starting to look more like an iguanodon or something like that. So, yeah. Ooh, this one, this, um, this, uh, launcher actually has a different, more skeletal launching thing for the skeleton. I will take out this next slice and okay this is my luck it's another 
triceratops. Uh, yeah. No, I did not look at these beforehand. I did not know I was going to get two versions of the same dinosaur. But here you go. Triceratops. Now let's see. That is all of them. So let me just put this guy together. We just have to put this on his back. Put this and this up. So this, I have to give them props. They didn't reuse the same uh, things for it. That this actually has different armor. If you look, uh, the the face is different, and the back is also different. So, yeah, these are really fun and really cool designs. So hopefully you like that video. Make sure to like, subscribe, comment your favorite dinosaur down below in the comments, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Oh, bye.